Welcome back guys to a different different kind of video today. Today we're going to be playing a 1 million point death brawl kind of situation. We've got a million points of all of the four different current in-game factions. So commandos, robots, big brick dudes who are not Lego because of copyright, and the good old classic army men. You can kind of see what we have. I'm going to point out a few of the core units. So we've got 20 medics over here. Loads of helicopters, loads of loads and loads of tanks, including five KV ones. Then a good good amount of an air force. I don't know how much work the big planes are gonna do, but we'll we'll see, hey. And obviously, there's tons of the cheap tanks as well. Over here, it's very much the same, just because everything's more expensive with it being bricks. It's just less. I don't know how much the big planes are gonna do in this one because let's be honest, these guys aren't great, but they're they're okay, but. Mm. And also quite a significant air force. I went a little bit of ham on this air force. I don't know why. I, I think it's probably because this is possibly my... This one here is definitely probably one of my favorite models, if not my favorite model. And then over to the robot side, it's just kind of like full-on Autobot slash Decepticons rolling out. So the robots are red, commandos are yellow just to stay so the commando force obviously the smallest because some of their tanks namely this one costs 50 grand and their planes cost 30 grand a piece so you just kind of run through a million quite quickly i made the commando is quite well almost look very decorative in the layout as much as i could because i had the the patience whereas with this lot i kind of was just like i am getting annoyed now um I had to work this out. I'm hoping this is fairly balanced, and this is kind of my one way of testing which faction is currently the best faction. Honestly, don't do it this way. <laughs> I probably should be doing this like one team at, against one another at a time so that we actually get a fair match. I am playing as purple, and I am hiding in here so that they don't kill me, and then I don't come back to my thing and have to be like, um, and also pull away them. So hopefully if I'm in the middle, they'll all come to the middle and have to fight in the middle. That would be that would be that would be very helpful. So let's let's get into it. Who are you rooting for? Make sure you leave a comment. Say who you're rooting for, who you think's gonna win. And if it's a surprise at the end, we'll have to have a conversation about it down there. Because I am I am totally curious as to who will win this. You can kind of see everybody who's coming in. I will try, what I'll try and do is I'll leave it as a comment, each of the lists, or some, I might even actually know. I'm going to leave it some pictures at the end. I'll leave the pictures of all the different commanders and all the army lists. So if you're interested in seeing how I split the forces up, you can do in more detail. Anyway, let's roll into it. Okay, so going into the game, we're finding a lot is cracking up. The planes are already starting to come up over here. I'm not sure... This is the one thing I will say is I feel like some of the factions that have got quicker units, aka these guys with their planes, are going to struggle because some of their big points are going to die very early on. Whereas factions like the robots, even though they've got no medics, might actually last it because they're all going to stay clumped up. Whereas these guys, like, come on, these guys are all the way in the middle, whereas their forces are like so far behind. Obviously, the little battle tanks are going to catch up, but how quickly? Who knows? There hasn't been an engagement yet, I guess. Everyone's coming to the middle. They're all wanting to find me, the AI in the middle that they want to target and take out. But guess what? They're not going to be able to, I hope. I really hope. I don't want them to. Okay, yeah, they're going They're going for each other. But the robots haven't even got here. The other teams have already lost things. Uh, over the, well, the Tans haven't, but the Blues and the Greens have lost things. The Greens have lost, almost lost a big plane already, but they've definitely lost a few Mustangs. There's a, quite a lot of destruction cracking off. It looks like a few of the stuff from the Tans might start to go down, but they are spawning in paratroopers over here. So we'll have to see if they can accomplish anything. I guess they're going to have to go against this first lot of... Well, over here. So yeah, the Tans are... Oh, a Tan Jeep is just crap. And a helicopter. Oh, we and some of these planes and helicopter. Oh, another helicopter. Oh, no, that was the same helicopter. But either way, there seems to be a good amount of war cracking off. The tanks are slowly merging in. There seems to be an array of tanks going this way along this route. Why are all the plastic jeeps coming over here with, like, no defenses and no, like, units to support them? The blues are... The Lego guys are seemingly doing a lot of work, actually, over here. They've... They seem to be annihilating the greens, which is 
and the standard guys, which is not really that much of a surprise. The I feel like the robots have kind of taken shelter under this picnic table that I set up and have kind of going to take advantage of that from the air forces that are currently second. Doesn't seem to be... There seems to be a lot of... Okay, there's a lot of guys down over here who are down. How, how much health are you at? You're going to... You're probably one-shotting a tank every time you hit one of the robots every time you shoot. You see, they're just like wiping them. Oh, okay, there's another G plane dead over here, though. Are you guys... Are you guys not going in? Is this... Oh, they're medics. So they've not... They've not found anybody. Their root in AI is a little different, isn't it? See, there has to be somebody near them. Oh, wow. There's like a whole host of greens over here. Oh, wow. Okay. What are you guys doing? Other than very little, it would seem. I feel like they're trying to do something. But I don't know if they're going to accomplish it. The tans seem to be fighting against mainly the reds at the moment. I have genuinely no idea how he's gonna who's gonna win this now. Like I was thinking, you know what, the greens are probably a write-off, but they've they've probably got the most amount left with just how many tanks went over there. Apparently, the air forces are like fully out now, though, so there isn't any air forces. There is this host of robots though cracking off over here. So what are they fighting against currently? Oh, the last few tans. Oh, there's like the little infantry units of Tams here. Is that paratroopers, maybe? No, I think they're just the standard guys that spawned in to start with. But the tanks are going to be coming in against the last few Tam tanks. There is actually a blue tank left. <coughs> actually, there's... Is there any more? No, but the, the, these healing tanks are helping. So that's... There's like a whole other unit of tanks over here. So there's, there's still quite a lot of greens left. But I don't know if the... Oh, well, there goes another robot. See, this is the thing. Is the greens stand a chance because of the amount of, like, heal health guys they have left? Oh, but over here, yeah, you see it. Now, this section of greens is dead. I'm saying, like, they're going to win. Okay, but these guys did... I mean, I'm surprised. So, whatever happens, what right now, Commando is the last place. Which is honestly shocking. Like, everybody kind of perceives them as the best unit in game. A best army and they've come last whatever we discuss and then obviously the but then obviously the block guys which is again not surprising um mainly because of the numbers they don't have as much firepower and then greens and then well then it's now it's between the greens and well the reds so robots versus the standard guys i honestly think the greens are gonna struggle but who knows like Nope, apparently these guys aren't going to be alive for much longer. Yeah, they're, they're dead. So we know that there's like... I don't know what's crackalacking over here, but there seems to be a lot of... A lot of tanks just walking around. What are you even aiming at? Just aiming at the sky. Why? Why? Okay, so they're... Over here, what's crackalacking? The last few tanks that were over here seem to be dying. I mean, the snipers are doing some work. These tanks seem to have bundled up. This is where the AI gets a little weird sometimes. Sometimes they just come and have a chat like this. I guess... I don't know where they're all going. Are they all coming to me now? Okay. That doesn't help anybody. You need to go fight a war. No, guys, come on. Go fight somebody. Please, please, please. If you've enjoyed this, by the way, please leave a like. Because this took ages to set up. And I, I made this map as well. So there will be a link to this map at some point. And if you want to try out, like, if you want to run through the, the mission on yourself, you can do and see how it goes out. Or if you want to use this map and make it to a skirmish map or something, you can do. So, you're... I don't know if you're just glitching. Everything else... I feel like, okay, I feel like we could call this a red win at this point. Mainly because the remaining units of greens don't really stand a chance. I mean, there's six tanks over here. Uh, I don't even, I don't know, actually, I'm curious as to whether or not a robot would win against them, free? Because the, the, the robot is worth, what, these are the M488 tanks, the M48 tanks, and they're worth, like, 3,200, whereas the robot's of 13,000 and a half. So, obviously, in terms of points, like, the robot should be the one to win this. I don't know if it will be, oh, there's another few robots, okay, yeah, it's definitely gonna win that. Where about the last few tanks? Okay, the last few tanks are now pushing in. 
Hmm. And they seem to be coming along. What are you doing all the way over there? There seems there's a few of them that went up top. I'm kinda glad they went up top. They were doing something cool. At least. Oh, they've destroyed some robots now that came over here. But I mean, as soon as these lot get a wind of them, they'll shoot them, right? They won't these guys won't just uh, continue aiming at me, right? Please. Guys, come on. Guys. Come up. There we go. Okay, see now they're gonna just 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 wipe oh my gosh. That tank didn't stand a chance. <laughs> and neither did that one. And I don't think these ones over here are either. But the greens over here okay, the greens over there are dead. There's like three tanks left and I honestly Yeah, they don't stand a chance, do they? There's just like the few little guys left who are just like Oh no, there's a few more tanks than I thought there was. Are you guys going to go do something or are you going to go still sit around here and try and get to me? What are you all doing? You guys, go! You're going to die because of this stupidity. Hey, honestly, if they all swarmed up, they'd have not even lost one. Okay, that one's dead at least. I mean... Yeah, this is beyond stupid. AI is weird in this game. But and 7T, if you watch this, please can you make a way that I can just have a battle without having to be in the battle? So, <coughs> I don't have to deal with the AI trying to get to me. Okay. AI, come on, you've got this. You've got this, take them out. So either way, I feel like, I feel like whatever happens now, I feel like because of the AI being a bit weird, we can call this a red win, and then... Greens in second, which is surprising. I I am I am genuinely shocked. Okay, well the yeah I mean these guys this guy's gonna well I was gonna say these guys but one of them just passed away. Come on tank, destroy it. Come on. Okay, here they come. They're all coming now. But they're gonna lose more of the big guys if they don't. Like they're gonna they're gonna just like lose more of their guys. And there we go. The reds. These guys have just proven their dominance of surrounding me. Well done to you, my lovely sirs. You are beautiful in your robotic madness. That was a little bit crazy. I have no idea what to think of that. That is completely upheaved what I thought of this game. But then again, it makes sense. Because like, if you consider the fact that the Tans with the Commandos, because they were going so fast, they were kind of leaving behind most of the troops, as I kind of said. So they were kind of doing it in like smaller waves. Whereas if they clumped up like the Red did, and this is why these guys probably won, is because they were clumped up, because they're all going at the same speed. It meant that these guys easily won. I think this is more a show on tactics and why it's sometimes best to clump up rather than do little runs. And like lose up your troops because if you have like one big body it's really hard to take it on whereas if you've got like one or two little things flying at you you're just gonna knock it out of the sky as these guys did anyway if you've enjoyed this it's a bit of a weird foray into seeing whether or not well which faction is the best faction let me know i'd love to hear what you guys think and how you guys would change the lists again i will leave the lists at this point at some point and we'll, yeah, leave a like, subscribe, and see you the next day. Bye!